Time management is the key to efficiency in many ways. We've created many tools to aid us in our management of time, from calendars to watches, alarms to schedules. In this video, we'll look at how Spreadsheet Web can aid in your business intelligence, specifically how it can do so by streamlining your time management into one fully customizable weekly timesheet and workflow. Here's a copy of the Excel file that will be converted. Bear in mind that this is only one example of a timesheet in Excel. Not only can the look and feel be adjusted to your ideal preferences, but it can be vastly different functionally, including daily or monthly timesheets. If you can build it in Excel, you can make it into a web application. Now I'll begin by looking at the application itself. This is our weekly timesheet. You can see that there are inputs for the first day of the week, as well as for daily hours worked. Using Spreadsheet Web's control panel, we're able to create multiple usernames for multiple users. Based on the user that is signed in, Spreadsheet Web detects the name and its associated hourly wage using a simple VLOOKUP equation that's built into the Excel file that was converted. An employee can sign in and simply enter the hours worked for each day of the week, as well as the date and then select Calculate to see their weekly wage calculated in the right-hand side. Once that employee has correctly entered their data for the week, they can hit Submit to submit the data into the application's data records. We've set up an email system, and upon submission, two emails will be sent out. One will go to the user who submitted the data, and the other will go to the administrator of this application. These email addresses are dynamic and specified by VLOOKUP equations in the Excel file as well. Here I've opened up one of these emails. You can see the custom text that we designated in the Excel file during conversion. It urges the administrator to verify the information in the newest data record. Since our current user has an administrative data role, we are able to open up the data tab from the applications. Here we can see a list of all the data records that have been submitted. This includes the one that we just submitted. If we have data for this application in the form of a CSV file, we can also import and export the data records. The final step in this system is the Business Intelligence Unit. We'll head to the Applications tab and select the dashboard for this particular web application. Here you can see a slew of charts and a pivot table, all functionally controlled by the filters on the left-hand side. These dashboards are fully customizable, but since the data here is relatively simple, we only need two filters to truly examine it in depth. We can use this filter to manipulate the data to only show specific employees using the checkbox filter. We can also use this slider to change the dates that we are looking to examine. The pivot table is separated into employees. Under each branch is a list of data records corresponding with dates. The truly amazing feature that streamlines this entire process is the fact that this is a real-time environment. All information that is processed into the web application that we saw earlier will be updated seamlessly into this dashboard and into the data record collection. That eliminates the need to recreate the application every month or file paperwork that can easily be lost. All of this is documented and saved for future evaluation and analysis. This means that you can build your entire dashboard report and business intelligence while your company continues to progress instead of stopping to develop and redevelop the same reports at every fiscal junction.